Hi guys, so by very popular request, I've managed to make an Arduino Pro Micro which executes ducky scripts from a micro SD card. It can be easier to use, so here in part one, I'll be covering how to set it up and how to use it. Then in part two, I'll be showing you how to make it a little sleeker by fixing it to a single chip and how to use dip switches along with it so you can easily switch between dozens, if not hundreds, of different ducky scripts on the same micro SD card. So let's get right into it. So I'll demonstrate it with this reverse shell script I've written. Link is in the description to the tutorial I've done on this script, by the way. All I need to do is save the script onto the microSD card named scripts.txt. Next, put the microSD card into the reader, plug it into the computer, and it works. No reprogramming of the Arduino needed for each script. Just load a new script onto the microSD card and you're good to go. In terms of hardware, it uses an Arduino Pro Micro, a microSD breakout module, and a microSD card, and a few jumper wires, all together costing barely $4. Links to each are in the description down below. So in order to set it up, you'll need to go to my website, link is in the description, click the GitHub project link, and then click clone or download, and then download zip. Once the zip is downloaded, you'll need to open it up and save the folder that's in there locally, and then open that folder, and inside there will be another folder, and then you'll need to open the Dequino microSD Arduino file. And then once that is opened up, just make sure your settings are correct, and upload it to your Arduino Pro Micro. So this script is an interpreter I've written, which takes ducky scripts from a microSD card, reads it, and executes it sequentially, meaning theoretically no max script size, though there are some considerations you'll have to take. More on that later. Next, you need to connect your Arduino to your breakout module, so connect the pins as shown here. On the module section, those are the names of the pins on my module, however the names of the pins on your module might differ slightly, but they should be vaguely similar. Then you'll need to format your microSD card to FAT32, Finally, just save your docu scripts onto your microSD cards named script.txt, and then you're set, pretty much. Just plug it back into the module and you're good to go. Now one last thing, I really recommend reading the keep in mind section on the GitHub page, because there are a few docu script features which aren't yet implemented, and there's a couple of other things which you should take into account. So in part two, I'll be covering how to use dip switches to switch between the hundreds of different scripts you could store on just one micro SD card, as well as how to make this thing a little more portable. So you definitely won't want to miss that. Remember to subscribe and follow me on Twitter. I'm at Satonic. So thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more hacking videos.